so much for keeping with us. Did I say thank you? <laughs> <laughs> it happens. It happens. This is a second language, right? Do not castigate me for that. But thank you so much for being in tune with us. And uh, do sure hope that you are following through with the conversation via our social media. Uh, remember that you can be interactive even as the show does get to progress. But at this point in time, we're getting into a discussion with the uh, Zambia Breweries uh, Corporate and Legal uh, um, Director in uh, Ezekiel Sekele. Uh, just discussing the new program that they are set to launch, uh, which is the screening and brief interventions, uh, which aims to identify uh, current or potential problems with the substance, with substance use rather, and motivate people at risk to change their behavior. The brief interventions should be personalized and offered in a supportive and non-judgmental manner. So according to the uh, World Health Organization, 269 million people have used drugs in the previous year, which is the year 2021. Three million deaths per year have been uh, due to the harmful use of alcohol. And uh, this is according to the Global Status Report on Alcohol and Health of the year 2018. And 15% of 152 countries have a third of primary care facilities implement screening as well as brief interventions. And this is exactly uh, what we are discussing this morning. The SBI, in short, refers to screening and brief interventions. This is a preventative program that aims at measuring an individual's alcohol consumption during outpatient and also wellness visits. And once the medical personnel measures the level of alcohol consumption for these individuals, the medical team is therefore able to come up with interventions or measures to help address, address the risk of harmful use of alcohol by those of our colleagues who are impacted by harmful use of alcohol by abuse of alcohol and we know that uh, at some of our centers in our country health centers it is reported that um, harmful use of alcohol particularly the illicit alcohol impacts significantly among others on mental health of our people now, is this not being uh, hypocritical that a beer manufacturing company is launching such an initiative that uh, Zambian breweries were being hypocritical by um, coming up with such initiatives such as screening and brief intervention. But I don't think that we are being hypocritical. I think that, uh, truth be told, we are a responsible company. We know the challenges that are in the market. We know that some of our colleagues abuse alcohol. Yes, alcohol is good for social cohesion. It has a rightful place in society, and if, con if consumed in moderation, alcohol brings people together for a better society. So for us as Zambian breweries, we want to see to it that when business, not for 10 days or for 10 years, but when business for 100 years, for the long haul. So sustainability is key in all the process of our business, but at the same time, caring for those who consume our products. And we know that uh, alcohol is not just about clear beer. There are wines, you know, spirits, home brews, and we know that significant number of our people in society consume the illicit alcohol, the, the so-called juntas to jirijiris. And this has to be controlled. However, for those people who consume alcohol in a manner that is not responsible, Hmm. All right. Now, um, how does Zambia Breweries uh, hope that after launching SPI, people will have access to the service? Ones who abuse alcohol, there is need to bring them back in society. There is need to help them through counseling. There is need to, to care for such ones through a proper structured counseling process. And that's why 
we are partnering with uh, the Church's Health Association of Zambia, CHAZ Charles, and obviously the Minister of Health, to try to see to it that we do help efforts that are being undertaken, for example, at the Chinama Hills Hospital. We do have people who have been impacted negatively by the harmful use of alcohol. And we want to stand up and assist these people, no matter what type of alcohol that they take, be it uh, the cheap wines or the spirits, the juntas or the jiris, doesn't matter. For us, we know that as long as we're in business of producing alcoholic beverages, we take it upon ourselves to show leadership and to partner with institutions such as uh, Charles, such as the Chinama Hills Hospital, such as um, the Ministry of Health, to help those of our colleagues who are impacted negatively. But at the same time, try to bring such ones back into a society so that they can be made. Thank you so much for that. It's good to know that um, these interventions are scheduled to take place. Now the question is, when and where are you going to be having this launch? This program, we are launching it in partnership with the Churches Health Association of Zambia, uh, CHAS. And uh, these are our implementing partners. They are our technical uh, implementing partner. And they will do all the technical work. These are um, people, medical personnel. They have experience in implementing such initiatives. CHAS is well known for having undertaken um, huge national exercise in the area of uh, public health, in the area of supporting government efforts uh, towards the management of malaria and many other diseases. So they have the outreach across the country. They have the, the, the qualified personnel. And for us as Zambian Braves, through the support of our head office, our parent company, ABI Foundation, they have put in funds to support the execution, implementation of this initiative in Zambia. And we're delighted that uh, Zambia, Zambian breweries, was selected by our um, parent company. Among so many countries globally, in America, South America, in, in Europe, in, in Asia, uh, in, in the Far East, in Africa, Zambia was among the top three countries, South Africa, Nigeria, and Zambia, to qualify for such funding. So we are excited that now, lastly, why is this a must-do initiative for Zambian breweries? That is working with partners uh, such as the CHAZ to implement the SBI initiative, which is the Screening and Brief Intervention in Initiative. So for us in Zambia, we're delighted that um, we are addressing the elephant in the room. The issue of um, abuse of, of alcohol, harmful use of alcohol um, by our members, some of our members in society, not just leaving it alone to the government, not just leaving it alone to the Chinama um, um, hospital to manage these challenges, but for us to come in and help them um, uh, have the necessary um, uh, resources the, the necessary uh, skills as well, the necessary um, um, uh, equipment where this will be uh, possible, the necessary training to the medical or, or teams um, within the hospital and also in the field so that we can together be able to help those of our colleagues who have been negatively impacted by the harmful um, use of um, alcohol. And we do have a lot of such people in our um, society, but we want to take this head on and work in partnership. Uh, uh, secondly, thank you so much for joining us this morning on the Weekend Marathon and bringing us to light of the intervention uh, in as far as uh, trying to curb uh, substance abuse is concerned uh, by the Zambian breweries. Thank you so much for bringing us to light of uh, the events that are scheduled to take place. We'll be taking a short break at this point in time and when we do get back, well, the Weekend